the work can appear diverse mm -hmm. um, in its nature, but it's structurally underpinned by a very simple meditation, mm -hmm. which is what I just told you, which is this idea of the notion of light and the city. Mm -hmm. And I don't mean light in a generic sense at all. I mean light within the city, mm -hmm. the, the perception of light within the city, the appreciation of light within the city, mm -hmm. and the notion of how the city affects and is um, mediated um, mm -hmm. by the projects which are reflections on these things. Place, but for me, Africa is a kind of phenomena. It has a kind of phenomenological power, mm -hmm. which is the emotional base from which I knew um, and felt Africa as a child and somebody who comes from Africa. I, so my, my experience of the place was this much more direct, innocent relationship to the phenomenology of it. Mm -hmm. It's geography. Mm -hmm. I want people to connect to um, what I mean by the diversity, I don't mean it ethnically, mm -hmm. I mean the diversity of the landscape, I mean the ecology. I came to Kyoto in 92, stayed um, until 93, mm -hmm. so I kind of wanted to experience a cycle, a year, seasons, mm -hmm. from spring to spring. Japan for me is about the kind of incredible consciousness around everything. <laughs> There's a, an incredible sense of consciousness about the meaning of everything, mm -hmm. um, which you see in, for instance, the way which the, the narrative of the tea ceremonies. I found that really moving, mm -hmm. and realized that um, that the construction of meaning was critical to uh, a way of kind of you know claiming and holding mm -hmm. uh, one who you are and your identity and how you move in the world. I visited uh, Soyu Fujimoto. Mm -hmm. um, I just wanted to meet him, just to sort of see mm -hmm. who he was, and I went to see his um, his housing project. Mm -hmm. um, I also went to see in Cohen um, Ito's mm -hmm. very beautiful theatre, mm -hmm. which I very much like. Mm -hmm. uh, it was a very, very beautiful project.